Thank you, Mr. Speaker. Proponents of uh, House Bill 5013 have typically tried to portray it as a binary choice uh, between the status quo and the contents of the bill as it was passed out of committee. Uh, in fact, there is a better way to do this that addresses the very serious problem of insurance that is far too expensive without gutting benefits for those who are catastrophically injured in car accidents. We don't need to preserve the status quo. I think everybody here understands that the status quo is a big problem. Car insurance is far too expensive. But this substitute would implement common sense reforms that would make sure that we prevent providers from charging exorbitant rates to auto insurance companies, that would institute a fraud authority to make sure that we crack down on fraud, waste, and abuse, that we put some reasonable common sense parameters around attendant care in people's homes, and most importantly, that we pass the resulting savings on to consumers, on to Michigan drivers and families by requiring a 25% reduction on the total car insurance premiums that Michiganders pay. This is a balanced, fair, and sensible approach that reduces rates without gutting needed benefits and without burdening the state with an additional $150 million Medicaid tab year in and year out. I urge my colleagues to adopt the substitute. Thank you, Representative. The question before the House is adoption of the substitute. The clerk will open the board. The substitute is not adopted. <laughs>